In this video, I'm going to show you how to sign into Minecraft Education Edition. Now, in order to do this, you will need a valid Microsoft account or Office 365 education account linked to your school or working organization. But anyways, guys, this will most likely work if you do have like an Outlook Gmail that your school does provide you. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on this option that does say sign in. However, if you guys don't have an account, you guys could also go ahead and try a demo lesson as well. But for this video, I'm just going to go ahead and sign in. And now it is going to open up Microsoft right over here. And now we need to go ahead and enter in our Office 365 education account email. So for this video, I'm going to be using my college email and password. So I'm just going to go ahead and sign in with my college account really quickly. All right. Now that I put my college email, I'm just going to go ahead and press on next. But yeah, this will basically work. If you also do have like an office job or something like that, then you need to go ahead and press on it next then it's going to open up a pop-up that looks like this and you need to go ahead and enter in your password once you're done with that you can go ahead and press on sign in all right so it might make you do some verification so make sure to go ahead and do it so on my outlook application it's kind of giving me this sign in message over here so all i need to do is i need to go ahead and just enter in the number all right and then you should get something that looks like this automatically sign into all desktops and website this is completely up to you so i'm just going to go ahead and select on yes all apps and then just wait for it a little bit. All right, so once you're done with that, it will now actually start downloading the resources. And as you're able to tell, we actually are able to play Minecraft Education Edition by signing in. So here's our account over here. And unfortunately, I don't think you can actually change your name. I think the name is automatically given to you based on your institution. So since I am a student, it's actually using my real name over here. But basically from here, you guys can go ahead and actually start playing. And here we are, guys, in Minecraft Education Edition. So yeah, it's a little bit unfortunate that the only way that we can really do this is by using a school or work email but please just keep that in mind before you try doing this if you guys found this video helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe see you later french fries